Hello, my name is John Richard and I'm the Director of Athletics here at the University of New Brunswick. It's my privilege to welcome you to our virtual celebration of the UNB Reds U Sports Academic All-Canadians for the 2019-2020 academic year. Normally, we'd gather for this celebration, but due to the continuing pandemic, that's not possible. Balancing the demands of being a student athlete is difficult. So much is expected of these people, both academically and athletically. Academic All Canadians are student athletes who, while participating at the varsity level, maintain a minimum 3.5 GPA or better. Achieving Academic All Canadian status is quite an accomplishment and one we're very proud of. 2019-2020 was a banner year for the Reds. For the first time, we're celebrating more than 100 Academic All Canadians. In fact, we're here to celebrate 129 Academic All Canadians. That's the most in one class the Reds have ever had. Congratulations to all 129 of you. Your hard work, dedication, and perseverance has not gone unnoticed. Take a moment to celebrate yourself today. You all deserve it. I want to thank all those who played a role in so many of our student athletes reaching this prestigious status. Deans, professors, assistant and associate professors, teaching assistants, faculty advisors, the university administration, and our staff. Fellow students, teammates, academic advisors, coaches, team staff, family and friends, they've all helped in getting you here. I want to thank them for what they've done and continue to do. To begin today's virtual celebration, I want to welcome UMB President and Vice Chancellor Dr. Paul Maserol. Since becoming UMB's leader, Dr. Maserol has proven to be a big supporter of our Reds program and can often be found in the stands or on the sidelines. We appreciate his continued support and welcome him to this event. Dr. Maserol? Thank you, John. I'd like to begin by respectfully acknowledging that UMB stands on the unsurrendered and unceded traditional Wallistiquai land. The lands of the Wabinaki people are recognized in a series of peace and friendship treaties to establish an ongoing relationship of peace, friendship, and mutual respect between equal nations. The river that runs through our city is known as Wollistiquai, along which live the Wollistiquai, the people of the beautiful and bountiful river. Wollastook is also called the St. John River. I am pleased, indeed privileged, to be here today to congratulate the 129 Academic All Canadians from the UMB student community. This year, our university had a record percentage of Academic All Canadians, 51%. Yes, 51%, that is not a typo. What an extraordinary result for our student athletes at UMB. This result says a lot about our program, but it says even more about you, our dedicated student athletes. You have proven that during these most difficult of times, UNB student athletes are not only dedicated to the studies and athletic pursuits, but also to the local community. Becoming an academic all Canadian is seriously impressive and takes perseverance, planning, commitment, and discipline in virtually all aspects of your lives. This past year has presented all of us with many significant challenges. As student athletes, indeed leaders, you faced those challenges head on and you stepped up for yourself and your community. You rose up through adversity and demonstrated what it means to be resilient. We're incredibly proud of all of your educational and sporting accomplishments. It really is a testament to your commitment and perseverance. I wanna take a moment to acknowledge and thank the many coaches staff and faculty who support all of our student athletes. By providing your mentorship and support, you are helping each of our student athletes reach their goals. Thank you. And congratulations once again to all of our impressive student athletes. You make all of us here at UNB very, very proud. Thank you. Thank you, President Maserol. It's my pleasure now to introduce you to Dr. Wayne Albert, the Dean of UMB's Faculty of Kinesiology. For many years, Dr. Albert has been a fixture at Red's events and a strong supporter of every aspect of our program. As the Dean of the Faculty, which oversees athletics, Dr. Albert also provides us with leadership and guidance. We're honored to be able to call him one of our own. Dean Albert. 
Thanks, John. I hope everybody is uh, happy and, and healthy. Uh, and uh, I'm happy to be here today and, and proud to be able to give you a sincere congratulations for the 129 academic All-Canadians this year. Uh, that represents over 50% of our student athletes, uh, which is a phenomenal uh, achievement. It's the highest both number and a percentage that we've ever had with, since the inception of this program, which is fantastic. And it is a testament to you, to you and your hard work, your dedication, your time commitment to both your athletics and your and your academic uh, ventures. And uh, that cannot be understated. Uh, I also want to put a big thank you out to the support systems on this university campus. That's the faculties at which you belong to, the deans and the faculty members that support our rights program. In-house, of course, the coaching staff, and all the, the, uh, the members of the Reds teams that make the locker room uh, have a culture of academic uh, excellence as well as uh, athletic excellence. And that transcends right up to our whole Reds program and through the faculty of kinesiology. So again, great sincere uh, congratulations to you at reaching this pinnacle of academic All-Canadian status. You deserve it. Have yourself a wonderful day. Thank you, Dean Albert, and thank you for all you and those within the kinesiology faculty do for athletics here at UNB. Without further ado, I'd like to introduce you to the Reds U Sports Academic All Canadians Class of 2019-2020. Again, at 129, this is the largest class in Reds history and the first time to feature 100 or more student athletes. In a normal year, each student athlete would be called up and presented with a certificate. This year, our coaches will name the Academic All-Canadians from their teams. It will move a bit faster than usual, so please pay attention. Certificates will be delivered to you in the coming days and weeks. I'm Chris Belloff, head coach of the Women's Cross Country and Track and Field Program, here to congratulate our 2019-2020 Women's Academic All-Canadians. Congratulations to Annalie LeBlanc, Natalie Tremblay, Emmanuel Martin, Caroline Burpee, Hannah Haynes McDonald, Hannah Cormier, Lynette Manuel, Isabel Lopez McLean, Anna Verity, Jillian Beck, Makeda Mekinen, Victoria LeBlanc, and Aaron McAver. Congratulations, ladies. The Reds men's volleyball team is proud to introduce our 2019 2020 Academic All Canadian class. These dedicated and hardworking student athletes are John Curry, Callum Doherty, Josh Dory, Connor Hergett, Eric Codrick, Andrew Luker, Austin Ross, and Thomas Vickers. Our women's soccer program are proud to introduce to you our 2019-2020 Academic All-Canadians. There are 12 of them. Emily Burton, four-time Academic All-Canadian, Sylvie Fecto, Aaron Foley, Emma King-Gesso, Ali Hughes-Goyette, a five-time Academic All-Canadian, Charlotte Sampson, Paige Wilson, Danica Lefebvre, Clarice Ramirez, Maddie Gertz, Eve McDonald, and Aaron Small. Hi, I'm Tom McCray, a coach with the Reds wrestling team. We are proud to have had two academic All-Canadians from the 2019-2020 season, Jonathan Morrison and Drew Colwell. Congratulations to all the Reds who have achieved this prestigious status. Chris Belloff again with the Men's Track and Field and Cross Country Academic All-Canadians for 2019-2020. Congratulations to Tyler Adams, Brandon Archibald, Aiden Donnelly, CJ Grant, Thane Hebb, Milton King, Adrian Kinney, Kevin Lee, Jared Manuel, Tim Green, Ryan Larder, Owen Lee, Mitchell Keane, Vardan Malhortra, Robert Williamson, Ian Baldwin, Ben Parrott, Chance Blackstone, Ian Vershore, Isaac Cole, Dawson Nanskeville, Bradley McMullen, Joshua Cummings, and Ethan Wilkie. Congratulations, gentlemen. The Reds women's hockey team is proud to introduce our 10 academic All-Canadians for the 2019-2020 season. This is the most we've had in the new era of women's hockey here at UMB. They are Hilary Cashin, Paige Grenier, Jenna McLean, Hannah Matchett, Ashley Stratton, Kendra Woodland, Amanda DeRoche, Lily George, Catherine Chadwick, and Elena Wagstaff. Hi, I'm Jeff Speedy, head coach of the UNB women's basketball team here at the University of New Brunswick. 
I would like to congratulate our 2019-2020 Academic All-Canadians. They are Crystal Osborne, Michaela Dodig, Bailey Black, Madeline Orlando, Marley Kerwin, Julia Summers, and Haley Tate. Great job, ladies. Congratulations. All right, I just want to say a big congratulations to the Academic All-Canadians for men's soccer. Constant growth in, in uh, athletics and academics is one of our core values. I want to give uh, big congratulations to both Alex Dodgson and Pat Cormier who achieved Academic All-Canadian while pursuing a master's degree. Also recognize Joe Hamilton who achieved his first Academic All-Canadian recognition in his third year, which uh, is a big switch from his first couple of years of schooling and really proud of him for that. And want to uh, also recognize Nick Ellingwood, who's gone on to pursue a med medical degree, and Matt Quigley, who's, who's currently pursuing a master's here at UNB, as well as other uh, athletes who are graduating, Evan Barker and Gabriel Cagliano, and returning athletes, Louis Charles Valancourt, Grant Takis, Tristan Nagoke, uh, all for achieving Academic All-Canadian for the 20. 19 2020 season. Congratulations, everyone, and all the other athletes. Congratulations as well. UMB Curling is proud to announce its academic all Canadians for the 2019 2020 season, starting first with our silver medalist women's team, Kira McLaughlin, Megan Balan, with our men's team, Connor Good, Alex Gallant and Jack Smeltzer. Congratulations. I'm Marta Bausch, head coach of Red Swimming Team. We're proud to introduce 13 academic All-Canadians from the 2019-2020 season. From our women's team, Maggie Gray, Bia Lockheed, Jennifer Moore, Nikki Connors, Julia Campbell, Lauren Goodine, Grace LeBlanc, Sarah Kelly, Alexi Sanford, and Hannah Casey. From our men's team, Eric Meng, Eric Staben, and Zach Duran. Congratulations to all Reds Academic All Canadians. Hi, I'm Christine Biggs, head coach of the UNB Reds women's volleyball team. I'm proud to announce nine student athletes achieving Academic All Canadian status from our team for the 2019 2020 season. They are Kelsey Bond, Kristen Burns, Julia Demert, Kelsey Ducart. Caitlin Chapman, Robin Anderson, Adora Royackers, Emma Burns, and Cameron Rogers. Congratulations to this group and to all the other 120 Academic All Canadians from the Reds this season. Hi, I'm Matt Daly, Associate Head Coach of the Reds men's basketball team. On behalf of Head Coach Brent Baker, I'm proud to announce Chris Burrell is among the Reds 129 Academic All Canadians for the 2019 2020 season. This is a great achievement for a wonderful member of our program. Hello, uh, Gardner McDougall here from the UMB men's hockey team and announcing our 2019-2020 Academic All-Canadians. Our UMB hockey program is proud to have set a team record uh, last year with 15 Academic All-Canadians. Starting off, our two goaltenders, uh, among the top goaltenders in hockey on the ice, among the top academics, uh, Rylan Peranto and Sam Harvey, both with a 4.0 plus uh, GPA. Uh, an excellent job for both. On defense, uh, we had a couple of first year players, Connor Hall, Ben Gagne to the 3.5 club, along with Tristan Pomerleau for his third time, and Joe Gattenby in his two years here has a 4.3 GPA. Up front, a number of forwards, starting with uh, freshman Brady Gill, more. Also uh, AUS scoring leader Tyler Bolin, Chris Bennett who's been a CIS All-Star, uh, second time as an academic All-Canadian, second time for Alex Goulet, second time Mark Razzle and Sam Dub McFalls also to the academic All-Canadian list. Matt Boucher and James McEwen, their second time as well. And in finishing off a fourth year computer science graduate for his fourth consecutive academic All-Canadian from Rossi, New Brunswick, Mark Simpson. Thanks to all our coaches for introducing us to our Academic All Canadians class of 2019 2020. Congratulations again to all 129 members of that class. 
In a group so large and distinguished, it's difficult to select individuals, but there are two individuals in our record-sized class who did stand out and have been named as UNB's top female and male Academic All-Canadians for 2019-2020. Our top female Academic All-Canadian was a fourth-year member of our Reds basketball team. Michaela Dodik was a second team Atlantic University Sport All-Star and her team's most valuable player, all while maintaining a 4.2 grade point average in her final year of her kinesiology degree program. Our top male academic All-Canadian was a fourth year member of the Reds men's track and field team. Jared Manuel was the Atlantic University sport champion in both the men's shot put and weight throw. He finished sixth in both events at the U Sports National Championships. Jarrett was named the AUS Track and Field Field Athlete of the Year. He was also his team's most valuable player. Manuel managed all of that while earning a 4.3 grade point average in his fourth year of business administration studies. Congratulations to both Michaela and Jarrett, both of whom have been nominated to Atlantic University Sport for consideration as a conference U Sports Top 8 representatives. That concludes our virtual celebration of the Reds U Sports Academic All-Canadian Class of 2019-2020. Congratulations to all of our student athletes who qualified for this prestigious honor. And thank you again to all those who support our Reds in their academic and athletic pursuits. That support means a great deal to all of us. And achieving an Academic All-Canadian status is not possible without it. Thank you for watching our virtual event. I look forward to seeing everyone in person to celebrate our Academic All-Canadian classes in the future.